Hey guys, so today we're going to cut open some geodes. We asked y'all a few days ago in a short if you'd like to see us cut some up for a video. Y'all said yes, so guess what? We're going to do it. Now, we're going to do some of these larger geodes and some of these smaller little sugar geodes. We're going to see what comes out of them. I'm kind of interested in this large one here because it has what we call rattlers in it. And what rattlers are is loose crystals on the inside of it. It sounds like a little rattle whenever you shake it. So what we're going to do, we're going to get over to the saw and start cutting them. We'll see you there. All right, so we're going to start with these little sugar geodes, and then we're going to work our way up to the big ones. So let's go ahead and get this turned on. Now it's about to get messy and dirty, so I'm about to get covered in water. Forgive me. But uh, yeah, let's go ahead and start this. Pretty cool right there. I didn't expect that. I didn't expect all that on the inside. Forget the problems, they're excited too. We're gonna get these cleaned up as soon as we get them in the house. But I'm kinda liking what we're seeing already. I hear you. I agree, Frog. I hear you. <laughs> Pretty cool. Alright, let's go ahead and continue with the rest of the small ones. So now that we got the smaller ones done, I want to go ahead and start cutting on some of these bigger ones. But I want to go ahead and lay these smaller ones out so you can kind of get a look at them a little bit before we clean them up too. So these are the little sugar geodes. And I got to be honest, this first one, the one I thought wasn't going to be great at all, ended up probably being the best one. I mean, look at that little crystal structure in there. It is pretty pretty. So. Let's go ahead and get these set aside so then we can clean them up and then we'll get a view on those. But first, let's get these big ones done. Alright, so we're going to start with this one and then we're going to move to the Rattler. So let's go ahead and start with this one. Crack that one open. It's maybe a flathead. Get it in between there and start cracking it up in the right way. My saw just did not have enough to cut all the way through it. So both of these are going to need to get popped open. So let's go ahead and pop these open. So part of it already kind of broke off. Bummer. But we're going to try to get the rest of this off. There we go. So ain't that cool? Look at that. Man, that's got a big old cluster in it too. And here's the little rattlers we were telling you about. They're the little loose ones that kind of rattle around in there. So, they make that little sound whenever they're in there. I like that one. I like that one. I think that was going to be tough to beat. You ready? Mm -hmm. Alright, here we go. We're about to crack it open now. Man, that's, a, that's actually a pretty big cluster. Mm -hmm. But, I mean, it kind of 
shoots into the neighboring area. It's kind of weird, but I like it. I like this part. I like that. I like this part. Mm -hmm. I like that. It's still got a little age in there. But this looks like a, like a scary cave. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so let's get all this stuff inside, clean it up, and then we'll kind of talk about what we see. So we're back in the house, and we're going to get a closer look at these stones. But I got to tell you, I'm pretty happy with the way some of these geodes turn out. And we'll start with the most impressive, smaller geode. Look at that there. I mean, I really love all the little crystals inside there. Uh, I was not expecting this one to be probably the best one out of all of them. Uh, it's just so shallow. Like, you know, there's a lot of, there's a big pocket for a lot of crystals in here. And I'm just loving it. This is another cool one, just because all the crystalline structures in there. I really like these like little pockets that are individual pockets within, you know. Uh, I think it makes it a pretty unique stone. And then let's throw you, show you the last three. The little one I thought was going to be more impressive, to be honest. The little one I thought was going to be most impressive because usually the little ones have the bigger pockets in them, from my experience. So, a little, little weirded out by that. No, not weirded out. I'm a little uh, disappointed by that. While I got you here, I want you to like, share, and subscribe. It really helps the channel out, and it helps us do some cool and more interesting projects with more and interesting geodes, as well as cool and more and interesting lapidary stuff, as well as jewelry, too. Thank you, and we'll get back to the video. All right, so here's the one that kind of broke into three. Look at there. Isn't that cool? Man, look at all that crystals. Look at all those crystals in there. And it's got quite a few rattlers. Now, I'm going to dump these rattlers out on the table. But that's just some of the rattlers we heard inside of that geode. So, I'm really interested in this one. I really like it. It's, I'm just I'm upset that it broke right here. It's like, uh, it could have been so much better if it didn't break. But, hey, uh, it still looks pretty cool. I like it. Um, tell me what you think about it, I like the um the deep pockets. Yeah, it looks like a canyon. Yeah. Like a snowy canyon. Mm -hmm. Like by exact words I was thinking. Yeah. That's what it looks like. It's really cool. And then these crystallinis, mm -hmm. little crystal clusters. Yeah. Little rattlers. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so now we're going to do the last one, which may be one of my favorites as well. Uh Laura's favorites I think is for a little different reason. I haven't really asked her, but we'll see. So this is the one that we did last, and I like this one, to be honest. I like the way it looks. I like that one side's pretty canyonous, and then the other side's got this little, like, crystal bridge that comes out. And I really like those little holes in there. Um, I think this one's the, my favorite because from our cutting and smashing of geodes, you don't really see that little bridge-like crystal structure, which, I mean, it just looks so cool. Tell us down in the comments below, what do you think was your favorite one and why? If you like this video, might do some more. Who knows, we can get some geodes from different places, get different kinds, so it'll be a fun time. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.